Thank you for your interest in the Vital Ice app. The EMS World Innovation Award-winning app made available to you by your local sponsor that cares. Your personal app is HIPAA compliant and all medical information is stored strictly on your personal device. In this video tutorial, we will show you how to download the award-winning Vitalize app and complete the setup process. Once you complete the necessary steps, the app will allow you to maximize the life-saving tools that significantly increase the odds of a positive outcome in a medical emergency as it is the most complete public safety app available. The Vitalize app can be downloaded on Android or Apple devices. Simply search for the Vitalize app when visiting Google Play or the App Store. To begin, you must review the Terms of Use page and place a check mark in the box stating you've read and agree to the Terms of Use. You must agree to the terms, otherwise you cannot continue with setup. You will be prompted for a four-digit code provided to you by a local sponsoring business. The unique four-digit code entered at setup unlocks Vitalize and all its features. Once the four-digit code is completed, our Outreach Sponsor page will be accessed. Scroll down to the bottom of the page and press Continue to proceed with completing the setup of vital health information for yourself, your dependents, and or elderly parents. Once all information is entered during setup, the information will be stored on your phone and can be accessed by selecting the Vital Info tab on the lower left-hand corner on the home page of your Vitalize app. Press Continue to proceed. This screen is where you will add your emergency contact information. This will include two personal emergency contacts, as well as your primary physician's information. Vital Ice allows you to access your contact list on your mobile phone to capture your emergency contact and physician's information for up to three physicians. When complete, press Continue to proceed. This next section will ask for your health information. At any time, you can skip a section by selecting Skip in the upper right-hand corner of your screen. Enter your blood type, health conditions, allergies, weight, and current medications. If you do not see your medications on the list, select Add Other Medication, which is found at the very top of the list, and select Done. A new screen will appear to add the medication name. Once you type in the name, select the blue Add button. The next screen will require detailed information about the medication, including the dosage and prescribing physician. Select Done, or to press the plus sign to add an additional medication. Select Done and continue to proceed and complete the medical history questions. A series of yes-no questions will be asked. All answers default to no. To answer yes to any of the questions, select the gray tab to the right of each question, and the tab turns green. This is to visually indicate you have selected a yes to answer that particular medical question. Once all questions are completed, you have the option to record a voice overview of your comprehensive medical information. Press the green Tap to Record Voice Overview button. A new screen will open. To press the blue microphone button to record, and press OK to allow Vital Eyes to access your microphone if prompted. Immediately begin recording and to press the red Stop button once completed. To review your recording, to press the blue arrow at the lower portion of your screen. If you'd like to re-record your message, you may do so by depressing the blue microphone again and repeating the steps. We encourage you to record a voice overview. If you are satisfied with your message, go back to the previous screen by selecting the left arrow at the top of your screen in the red header. Once back to the Medical History screen, select the blue Continue button to proceed. The Vitalize app allows you to also add dependent information which could also include elderly parents. Complete their information to include the name, nickname, date of birth, blood type and allergies, current medications, medical conditions, and physician's name and phone number. Press Save and add additional dependents. Once all dependents are completed, press Done. There are five tabs on the bottom quadrant of the home screen. The vital info is the information that we just completed. On the First Aid tab, we have included nationally recognized step-by-step -step first aid instructions for 16 of the most common emergencies which are updated regularly as the national protocol changes. These steps can assist you when EMS is unavailable or until help arrives, such as with an asthma attack or diabetic emergency. We encourage you to seek help for all medical issues and injuries. When opening the Information tab for each type of issue, 
a Dial 911 button is readily available on each screen for injuries or issues that could become life-threatening. It is important to add your insurance card. You may do so by taking a photo of your card. Tap the center of your screen. This will open the options to access your phone camera to take a photo of your card unless it is already saved in your photos. Once you take the photo or select the photo to use it, it will automatically upload into the Vital Ice app. At any time, you can go back to the Insurance Card tab, select it, and remove or update the photo. The next tab is the Reminders tab. On this tab, you can set up alerts for medications, physician appointments, and immunizations. To add a new reminder, select the blue Add a Reminder button and specify the reminder type. If selecting a medication reminder, a window will open allowing you to select from a list of preset medications. You can also add a new medication into the list and follow the same steps as we did in the prior setup procedure. If you are selecting physician reminders, a list of physicians from the emergency contact list previously set up will be open for you to select from. If selecting immunizations, select the date and time. After each step, select Done to save each reminder. Once the reminder has been set, a prompt will appear confirming your reminder setup. Press OK to continue, and you will see the reminder on the Reminders view. You may edit by depressing the pencil on each reminder, and you may delete by depressing the trash can icon. The last tab on the home page is the More tab. This is where you will access the settings and additional information in your app for editing. The Edit information allows you to edit your personal, medical, dependent, and emergency contact information. To add a photo to your personal profile, select Add Photo. This will open your camera to take a photo or select an existing photo saved in your photo album. If you select Photo Album, the Vital Ice app will prompt you to authorize access. Select OK to proceed. Once the album is open, select your photo and then select Choose on your mobile device. This will upload the photo image into the Vital Ice profile. To proceed editing, Scroll up and press Continue. The next feature on the More tab is the Custom Wallpaper Lock Screen Image. This feature allows you to create a custom lock screen image that will contain your vital information and emergency contacts for first responders. This gives first responders a head start with your medical information if your phone is password protected or when the app is being located, saving precious time. To create your Vital Eyes lock screen photo, access this screen. Press the blue Select from Photos button and select a photo. If the app does not allow access to your photos or videos, enable access in Privacy Settings on your phone. Once enabled, select a recent photo. It is recommended you select a full screen portrait, vertical, cropped to 9 16th aspect ratio. If you're not familiar with how to do this, select the Show Me How button above the Edit Wallpaper Image button. These instructions will help you. Once the wallpaper image is created, it will appear in your photos on your photo gallery in your phone. A prompt will appear advising you to go to your photo gallery. To save the image, select OK and the image will be assigned to your wallpaper lock screen image. This varies depending upon what phone you have. Consult with your phone carrier if you are not sure how to upload an image to your lock screen. The Reset App setting allows you to completely clear and reset the app to start from the beginning. Be careful when accessing this setting as all user data will be immediately deleted and this cannot be undone. The Feedback and Testimonial setting allows you to submit information directly to us and our developers to improve our app. Please submit suggestions and or testimonials if you have benefited while using the app from a medical standpoint. We'd love to hear your story. The Email My Information setting sends your vital health information including your insurance card and other photos you've uploaded to physicians, emergency room, or anyone you designate. Enter the correct email address. Vital Ice will verify the email for authenticity. Tap Send to email immediately. The information will come from Vital Boards as the sender. The email will be emailed using a secure encryption method and will not be stored, copied, or forwarded to alternate addresses by Vital Boards LLC. The Manage Emergency Group Settings is where you are given the opportunity to custom script a message that can be sent immediately to emergency contacts you designate. 
These emergency contacts can be the same or different from those previously set up. This message will be sent via SMS text message to the contacts you designate in the Settings tab, along with your location, when activating the Notify Emergency Group feature in the Emergency area on your homepage. Keep in mind, your GPS location services must be enabled on your device. We encourage you to talk to your emergency contacts after downloading and setting up this app so they are aware of this feature and will be informed in the event an emergency arises and they need to take action. You may edit the text that will be sent to your designated contacts by simply typing in the message you choose. Please remember, you and the designated contacted individuals must both have texting services active with your cellular providers. Standard text rates and other carrier fees may apply. The default text will read as follows. This is not a joke. I am in an emergency situation. Please call, come, or send help. Click here for my location. The About Helpful Tips settings will provide you more information on our company and our history, how information is stored, your privacy, and additional helpful tips. We encourage you to update your information frequently, especially after each doctor's visit, noting changes to your current list of medications and medical status. Move the Vital Ice icon to the first page of app icons on your phone so that it appears on your screen in the upper left-hand corner. This is the designated area for in case of emergency apps and will assist first responders in locating your patient information more efficiently. To do this, tap and hold on the Vital Ice icon for several seconds. Then move the icon to the top left-hand corner and release. Tap the Home button when finished. Utilize the custom wallpaper lock screen image to auto-populate some of your medical information on the left and right sides of your lock screen. This will save EMS precious time when trying to access your app or if your screen is locked. Consider not utilizing passcode or fingerprint security as a requirement to gain access to your device. Locking your device would of course prevent first responders and or friends and family members from viewing your information in an emergency situation in the event you are incapacitated or otherwise unable to speak. If you must lock your mobile device, make sure at least your family members have a passcode or in case of fingerprint access, make sure to register their fingerprints as well. If you have unlocked the Pro features with a four-digit code, make sure you keep current your emergency group contact list, complete with their mobile phone numbers. Your medical information is confidential. Therefore, we do not suggest that you leave your mobile device unattended or in others' possession that you do not fully trust. Your information is safe and stored only locally on your device. However, your information can be emailed to any email address via the Email My Information feature within the app. The Email My Information is intended to be an efficient tool for first responders to transmit your information to the ER or other medical emergency facilities in the event of an emergency. The email will be emailed using a secure encryption method and will not be stored, copied, or forwarded to alternate addresses by Vital Boards LLC, the creators of the Vital Ice app. Your Vital Ice app is now set up to use in case of emergency. The most important button to use is the Tap for Emergency button, which is located on your home screen. This opens a screen offering you the options to dial 911, sound an audible alarm, or notify your emergency group. Dial 911 dials 911 with immediate GPS location, a process that can take up to 10 minutes for 911 dispatches. Sound audible alarm sounds an audible alarm so that someone can be located in difficult to see situations. Notify Emergency Group sends an immediate group SMS text notification to your designated emergency contact group along with a map showing your GPS coordinates and location. The custom message will be the default Vital Ice message or your custom message if you chose to set this up in the More tab under Manage Emergency Group Settings. The Vital Ice app and Vital Boards provide life-saving information to medical staff when you are unable to do so. We hope this tutorial proved to be helpful in setting up your app. On behalf of your local sponsor, we thank you for choosing to use the Vital Ice app. Please visit our website at vitalboards.com, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and connect with us on LinkedIn and YouTube. Thank you for watching.